Hello, I'm Kent McDill. It was an unusual week to be a Chicago Cubs fan, although most weeks are that way for Chicago Cubs fans. Our Millionaire Corner offices are in suburban Chicago on the north side, where Cub fandom is second only to Chicago Bears fandom in terms of enthusiasm. It's a frantic fan base because it's been 106 years since the Cubs last won the World Series. On Monday of this week, Cubs phenom Chris Bryant hit two home runs in one game for the first time in his young career. Bryant, who is very, very media savvy, said he wished he had done it one day later on the anniversary of Ryan Sandberg's big two home run game. What big two home run game, you ask? Well, in Chicago, it's a big deal that Hall of Fame second baseman Ryan Sandberg hit two home runs in a game in back-to-back -back innings back on June 23, 1984. That was 31 years ago. That game meant nothing in the long run, but it's celebrated anyway. Nobody knows why. Oh wait, we do know why. The Cubs have nothing else meaningful to celebrate. On Tuesday of this week, a fan holding his six-month-old baby caught a foul ball, sticking his hand into the field of play, and in the end, costing the Cubs an at-bat because the batter was deemed out due to fan interference. But the fan was celebrated in town and nationally for making the catch while maintaining a grip on his son. The man was also berated for having his infant son sitting in the first row down a foul line where danger exists on every swing of the bat. That big moment in Cubs history brought to mind the famed Steve Bartman game, where a fan reached out for a foul ball that some believe Cubs outfielder Moises Alou could have caught. That game was in the eighth inning of the fifth game of the 2003 National League Championship Series, and Cubs fans blamed Bartman for killing the team's chances to advance to the World Series for the first time since 1945. Poor Bartman has never shown his face publicly since, even though it was the Cubs who blew a lead after that play in foul territory. So that's the week that was in Cubdom. Weird. I'm Kent McDill. Thanks for watching.